Welcome all. In this travelogue, I would like to share some of the videos and images I have taken on my trip from Germany to Italy, Genova, together with a good friend of mine. His name is Abdul Ahad. So we have chosen Genova for a couple of good reasons, mainly because its location at the Ligurian Sea, which is an inlet to the Mediterranean Sea. It has a background in art and history and the road trip itself is enriched with the natural beauty from Germany to Switzerland and Switzerland to Italy. So the trip has started from Rastatt which is a small town in the south of Germany near to Karlsruhe. As mentioned before we have Genova as our destination in Italy. So looking at the map, we will start from Rastatt, which is near to Karlsruhe, then we will go to Genova, our destination. And the total distance is roughly around 650 kilometers. And the major cities, we will pass by Basel, Luzern in Switzerland, and then to the Lugano, Como, Myland, and we will reach our destination in Italy, Genova. So let's begin our journey.
so this lake is actually near to the city Italian city Burino and it's a very nice lake and it has very nice scenery so there's other tourists here so people are actually coming here so we are actually making a pause here I mean we have a short stay we have to spend our night here and then we will move to Como and then we'll go to furthermore to our destination
main train station in Genova. So my route is now to go from the train station to the Ferrari Square or it's a kind of city center where you have the aquarium and museum and other kind of things. Genova is located in the Italian's northwest region called Lucarian, which is famous for the art and history. Its Roman architect and famous shopping arcade called Galleria Mazzini. Piazza di Ferrari or Ferrari Square is the city center of Genova which connects the city in every direction. This is the statue of Teatro Carlo Felice who was the king of 18th century and who has established the Department of Modern Theatre. Behind his statue is the 18th century auditorium architect designed by Carlo Brabino, which can accommodate 2,500 people at a time. Porta Soprana or Soprana Gate, much like we have Lori Gate in Lahore. The city gate was built in 1155 Casa de Colombo or Columbus's house. As most of us probably don't know, one of the famous personality from Genova is Christopher Columbus, an Italian maritime explorer, was also born in Genova on 31st October 1451. That time, Genova was an independent state and known as Republic of Genova. Christopher Columbus spent his childhood in a small stone house situated at the Porta Superana and he has opened the gateway for Europeans to discover and colonize today's Americas.
Oh, screw it. So thank you for watching and see you in my other videos. Bye bye.